Newport News in Review starts right now. Hello, I'm Aaron Pritchett, and welcome to this edition of Newport News in Review for the month of December 2010. Well, it's cold, but it's also the most wonderful time of the year that gives us a chance to come together, think of others, and spread a little holiday cheer. And no matter if you're 2 or 92, the inner child in each one of us comes alive, where we hope and dream to continue annual holiday traditions and create new memories that will indeed last a lifetime. And although there are plenty of places and several events to consider throughout Hampton Roads this holiday season, there's one particular place with one very special event that shines above the rest, and it's right here at the very festive City Center at Oyster Point along Jefferson Avenue and Thimble Shoals Boulevard. They say that big things come in small packages, but of course you would never know unless you take the time to unwrap the magic of the City Center at Oyster Point. By day, it offers up quite a sight to see. Stunning buildings, a flourishing five-acre fountain, and plenty of places to explore. But as darkness falls, especially on that one very special night in December, the City of Newport News, the Department of Parks, Recreation and Tourism, and other Newport News Town Center partners work together to transform this special place into a winter wonderland, where the lights are bright and the people are plentiful, for an event that indeed shines bright, because for the last seven years, Holly Dazzle has become an experience like no other, helping to put the City of Newport News on the map and inquiries from all across the country on how to emulate such a successful event here after year? Well, the answer lies simply in giving the thousands and thousands of people who have come to make this event an annual holiday tradition what they want. Festive decorations, twinkling lights, a friendly wave from the jolly old man himself, plenty of free activities and things to do. Look! Yay! Not to mention exciting entertainment that allows young and old alike to let their talent shine and spread that Christmas cheer. Joyful all ye nations rise, join the triumph of the skies with But even with all the sights and sounds that overwhelm the senses, it's tonight's finale that has helped to make Holly Dazzle, well, quite dazzling. As close to 30,000 people pack in tight up and down the streets and all around the fountain to set their eyes to the sky for one of the most premier holiday lights and fireworks shows on the East Coast. And as the last sparkle fades, the roar of the crowd erupts and the 45 foot high LED Christmas tree puts on a little lighting show of its own, you can now see that big things do indeed come in small packages. As the memories and traditions that are unwrapped here at the City Center at Oyster Point, year after year, can last a lifetime. We are proud to feature the beautiful City Center at Oyster Point and the very successful Holly Dazzle event. Made possible by our very own Department of Parks, Recreation and Tourism staff, the City of Newport News, various city departments, and a long list of fine sponsors that continue to make it an experience like no other year after year. Well, December has been another busy month, so let's take a look at what's been going on right here in the City of Newport News. It's a chance to get suited up and geared up as these Newport News firefighters turn up the heat in an effort to show you what happens when safety isn't at the top of your list and that all the joy and excitement that the holidays bring can go up in flames in an instant. How are you? No lines, no worries, no problems, Sweet. as good old St. Nicholas makes a little stop off the beaten path to take a step back in time to enjoy the simple things in life, as the good little boys and girls tell of all their hopes and dreams this holiday season. Oh, good. You guys all secured your weapons? Yes, sir. All right, hands up. Let me see what you got. And to be the best, you have to train to be the best no matter where it takes you and what it may put you up against. But as this training scenario unfolds, you better believe that the Newport News Police Department is always doing whatever it takes to expect the unexpected so that they can do their duty to serve and protect day in and day out, night after night, 365 days of the year. Oh, 